guys welcome back to a brand new funko pop video here on the channel and i actually haven't done one of these in a very very long time but chalice collectibles decided to drop a brand new mystery box so what we ended up doing was we bought five of them so this video is well not video uh like i guess series is gonna be cut up in five different sections we want to see which of our five boxes is going to be the best uh, which I'm very very excited for if you guys are excited for this video drop a like make sure to subscribe So you guys don't miss any of the series and let's get started with our mystery box opening Okay, so before we actually get started with opening it I want to go over pretty much what the mystery box is all about. So it is a $50 mystery box It's $60 value guaranteed the PPG was taken on 616. So about a week ago give or take uh, There's gonna be one exclusive pop uh, and five common and this is anime only so this is gonna be pretty cool not everyone's gonna get a grill like always one out of every six boxes will have a chase like normal um this was limited to 500 boxes limit five per person of course i got it so let's take a look at some of the grails okay so hopefully i do have the grail image somewhere on the screen so you can go over it uh but there is a lot of my hero academia stuff that i can definitely add to my collection and that's really my goal uh, like the Chase Ochaku, or any of the Ochakus, to be honest, the All Mights, the Bakugos, the Dobbies. I could go for any of those, but if we do get some Dragon Ball stuff, that is some good options as well. So I think without further ado, let's pop it open and go for it. All right, so we have the first box. Uh, I'm, I won't lie, there's six boxes in here, but I could only order five, so I'm a little concerned, conflicted. Um, there should be, what, six pops, so I guess they made it work. Uh, so I guess we're only gonna count the first six pops that we see in this opening and that'll be our first box I won't lie. There's six Funko pops here So either one of these boxes is legitimately just empty just to fill in the gap or they sent me an extra box I highly doubt it though um, But let's see. Oh, yeah, no, there is one that's just straight up empty. Okay, that makes more sense now I was a little concerned. I was like, how did I end up six boxes? Is there they're filling the gaps? Um Let's go into it. So my goal is I want to get a lot of the My Hero stuff. I haven't gotten any of the newer stuff. Uh, so hopefully I can get some of that. I've been telling myself I want to collect Jujutsu Kaisen, but I haven't actually started collecting that either. So let's start off with this. We got Kumugi, and this is, I believe, normally a Hot Topic exclusive. Uh, this is from Hunter x Hunter. I do not collect Hunter x Hunter, but it is one that I already have gotten in the past, and I believe... Yep, I'm looking at it right now. I haven't actually gotten the chance to get rid of it just yet, so I think it's okay. It's a great, it's a good start to, to this opening. Uh, of course, we'll take a look at the PBG afterwards to see if we broke even or how things played out. Ooh, this one's pretty cool. We got Himiko Toga, one of my favorite characters from My Hero Academia. I think I might already have this in my collection. I'm not entirely too sure, but it's still a really, really cool Funko Pop to have. I'll definitely take a look to, uh, at that to see if I have it in my collection. Noel from Black Clover. Now, this one's definitely something that I don't have in my collection. It's something I kind of want to collect. Black Clover, Jujutsu Kaisen, things like that. Really, really cool Funko Pop. The only problem that I have with this Funko Pop is I have seen it at my local Five at, uh, five Below. So, I, I know it's not really worth too much, but it's still a really cool pop. I know not to really expect too much because we know that uh, it is five comments and one exclusive. But I'm hoping to hit one of the big hitters for sure. We have a Scar from Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. This is another one that I've been considering collecting myself because I think I ended up with an Edward Chase. I bought a collection and I think that was in there as well. So definitely something that I am considering picking up and starting a collection with. Plus, if I'm not mistaken, Full Metal Alchemist has the best fusion in all of anime. So the final common i see it already and low-key i'm kind of mad but at the same time i can't really be too mad the last common that we have is caterpie we have caterpie from pokemon and if you guys know me and, and my collection i do have kind of most of the pokemon stuff especially when it comes to the commons but it's still pretty cool uh, i think out of this set yeah on this set the pidgeotto was the hardest one to find for some reason but I know that Caterpie is completely okay. We could probably host that for uh, like a giveaway, uh, maybe for a subathon coming up soon for my birthday on Twitch. So make sure to follow me over there. Uh, I do a lot of Pokemon stuff. So is that for if that's for you, that's for you. And the final Funko Pop that we have is going to be the exclusive Funko Pop. And don't get me wrong, when I kind of showed it, 
I think you guys kind of saw what it is. I've seen it firsthand already. I've had it before. I've opened it from their mystery boxes before. And that is going to be Lounging Inosuke. And of course, this is normally exclusive to, I believe, Box Lunch. But it does have the special edition sticker. But it is the newer special edition sticker. So there is that to consider as well. That's pretty cool, though. I think I already have the Box Lunch sticker. I could be wrong. Um... I really wouldn't even know where to look to see where I would have it at. This place is a mess. But still, pretty cool. Um, not bad for the first box, but let's take a look at value. Okay, so we're going to take a look at value on uh, HobbyDB because I feel like that's the best place to take a look at value. Uh, the Funko Shop is not the most accurate. So we'll start off things with our Caterpie. Caterpie is coming in at a solid $10. So we want to make sure that we have the, these added up for sure. I want to see how much we make at the end of the box. Next, we have Toga. Let's see what Toga is coming up as. Let's see. Toga is coming in at $19, almost 20 bucks. Definitely got to see if I have this in my collection. Scar from my uh, Full Metal Alchemist. I was going to say My Hero. No, wrong wrong anime. Wrong anime for sure. Uh, it is just a comment, so it's coming in at 12 bucks. That's not too bad, actually. Noel from Black Clover. Now, it's probably going to give me like a $9 value or something like that. But again, I've seen it at uh, 5 Below. <laughs> the value's not there. It can't be. Uh, PPG says 16 bucks. I, I don't know if I, I'll use the $16 for PPG, but I've seen that five and below guys. And then the last one is going to be our Kumu G. Now this one I would have been more excited for. It isn't exclusive. So that's cool. Something cool to look forward to. However, it does normally have a chase. So that's why the value isn't the greatest there. Uh, for some reason it does not want to scan. Did it scan? Yeah. So the chase is good value. This is just 18 bucks. It's not much. And then finally, for our hit of the box, we're going to take a look at this Lounging Inosuke. Uh, I believe, again, it's normally a box lunch exclusive, but it is popping up. It is a nice little $27. It's not bad. Okay, so after calculating the whole box, it's, it's kind of interesting to see. Uh, the value of this first box is coming in PPG at 102 which is kind of insane considering this is kind of a low-tier box. So even at a low tier box, leaving with at least $40 more in value, I consider it a W. A win is a win. That's going to be it for our first box though. Make sure to come back tomorrow because we'll have the next one up and running so you guys can see what I get in the next box. Hopefully we can hit one of the big grills so I can show that off for you guys. But thank you guys so much for watching. Click that like button, subscribe, turn on those notifications, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.